Hello, awesome students. Today I'm going to show you how to conclude your descriptive writing. What is a descriptive writing? It describes people, animals, or places in a way that a picture is created in the reader's mind. Now that you already wrote your introduction and details, it is time to write the conclusion. The conclusion is the final thing to be read by the reader. Step 1. I want you to reread your paragraph. Why? So you can pick up the strongest description and rephrase it. Or provide final thoughts, tie all the thoughts together. But do not add anything new. For example, if you were describing lions, you can end it like this. Lions are the strongest animals in the jungle. If you were describing the tallest tower in the world, so at the end you can say, Burj Khalifa is the tallest tower in the world. Step number two, you can add transition words. This can tell the reader that you are ending your paragraph. Examples of these words, finally, lastly, in the end, as a result. So, let's get back to our previous example. Now, we can add, as a result, lions are the strongest animals in the jungle. Or, in the end, Burj Khalifa is the tallest tower in the world. Well, now that you have already finished writing, it is time to do some editing. First, I want you to read it out loud and listen for any unclear sentences. Well, you can read it out loud to your sister. Uh oh, looks like she's sleeping. Then... Read it to your parents and they can help you with the editing. Well, now it's time to edit all the unclear sentences or the mistakes that you made. Then you can add some adjectives to make it look clearer or replace the weak adjectives with strong ones. For example, instead of saying big, you can say enormous. And check capitalization and punctuation. Did you put the right punctuation marks? Did you capitalize proper nouns? Well, that's it for now. I cannot wait to read your paragraphs. See you soon.